Good morning everyone, today we're going to be talking about how to put markers on your map because I know a lot of people have been asking me, Carol, how do you know where all the minerals are? How do you have all those little icons? Well, in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you how to do that. But before we jump into the video, if you're new to the channel, upload NGS content daily. So if you do play this game, I would really appreciate to subscribe as it really helps out the channel. Anyway, without further ado, let's begin the video. So if you play the game on mouse and keyboard, you're simply going to press F10 to open up your map. And once you're in this map over here, you're going to notice that I've got all these little icons over here, like Chris Mango. You can see there's an Ephetis Argo over here. You can see there's Chris Meat, there's Hexasite. And you can see around the map that I've just placed a bunch of these little markers to let me know where to collect all the different resources that I need for my recipes. Well, in order to place an icon on the map, it's actually pretty simple. If you look at the bottom of your list right here, it actually says right here, place waypoint, and it tells you that it's the letter R. So you're simply going to press R, whatever you are, then you're going to switch over from pin to icon. Once you're in the icon area, you can actually click on the picture to change it to whatever it is. Let's say you want to mark seafood or fruits or vegetables or just like a rare item over there. If it's a veteran, if it's rapids, if it's meat in general, you have all of these different icons that you can use in order to signify something so that you can find it very quickly. Now you can only place waypoints on areas that are highlighted. So you see when I'm highlighting over Stia outskirts, the line stops around here. So I won't be able to place a point over here because it doesn't highlight because it simply just doesn't exist in the game. You can't actually go out here yet. There's a giant barrier that won't let you go further. That's why you can't place a waypoint there. However, let's say we want to mark the veteran in the Stia outskirts. If you want a little bit more precision, you can scroll up to zoom into the map and then press R and right here you can place veteran over here and let's write vet then you can place the icon and voila now we know that there's a veteran that spawns over here because we marked it ourselves however let's mark something a little bit more useful so as we know in central alio this is where you get your alpha reactors so we can zoom in on central alio and we know right here at the cave entrance is where there's a bunch of alpha reactors so we can mark here again we go here we go to the treasure icon and we go alpha reactor and we can place icon so we know there's alpha reactors over here there's another one right here as well so i'll also mark this with alpha reactor and the last spot that has an alpha reactor is all the way up here so we'll also mark this with an icon and write alpha reactor so now that I've placed all the markers here to remind me where all the alpha reactors are, it's very, very simple to find everything, even if I do forget. Now, keep in mind that this is account-wide. So regardless on what character you log on, what ship you log on, everything will be saved over here. All your different waypoints, all your different markers will be saved and will transfer over. So it's going to make your life really, really easy. However, what about my console players? Well, for my console players, you're simply going to press the start button over here. You're going to go to world. And once you get to the world menu over here, you're going to notice at the bottom, there's place waypoint and the button is square so again you need to find a highlighted spot over here so let's say we want to mark another veteran over here we can zoom in and we can place a marker right here because this is another veteran right here again we can change the marker from that to this and we can go to write note and we can type in vet over there place icon and voila now we have two markers over here signifying where all the veterans are so all you need to do is literally just look down here and see what the button actually is now because i do have a playstation 5 controller plugged in that's why all the symbols have changed into the playstation symbols however again if you want to change them back into like xbox symbols for example you can always go to control settings over here and change them from symbols into letters once you change it to letters it will show the xbox controls so when i open up the map over here you can see place waypoint is going to be x okay and now let's say that you've unplugged your controller and you want to go back to mouse and keyboard but all of your symbols are totally messed up how do you switch that back again we're going to go to systems control settings and right here our control display type we're going to change back to keyboard and voila everything is back to mouse and keyboard special thanks to all the members for supporting the channel it really means a lot to me thank you again but yeah that's all i wanted to cover in today's video hopefully you guys found it helpful if you did i would appreciate a like and a subscribe and i'll see you guys in tomorrow's video bye